The Archie Giant series from Archie Comics kicks it off in 19. 19- 89 with this number 593 the betty and veronica christmas spectacular we'll show you the back cover as well so now you've seen the front you've seen the back let's get right down into it i'm going to shine the light on it so you can see exactly what you're going to be getting every nook and cranny if you were here in the gallery with us you'd want to pick this up look at it shine the light make sure you know every little flaw and imperfection before you decide to bid. This is going to go into your collection, so you want to make sure you know what you're going to get. You can take my word for it, but we'd much rather you use your best knowledge, judgment, and intuition. We're also going to show you a few of the interior pages. That way you can see any kind of damage. You'll see the condition of the staples, which are still looking shiny and bright. No mold spots, no water damage, no mildew or anything like that coming through. All these coupons are still in place. They haven't been cut or snipped, best of our knowledge. No writing that we we see so all around pretty good and then we'll finish it out on this uh, splash right here so you can see how well is the cover holding up is it still affixed to the book it looks like it is is there any writing on the inside uh, and is there any hidden damage that we don't know about with the inside cover and all around a uh, good piece right here from 1989 this is the Archie Giant series number 593. We're going to do it again with number 223. There's a little jinx in there from 1974. We'll flip it over on the back so you can see. Looks like a little bit of a, a dog ear on that one, but we'll check that out in a moment. Again, let that light do its wiggle jiggle. We do it in 4K so you can really see um, every little nook and cranny so you can stop rewind zoom in get all the way down in there i'm not seeing too much spine issues a few ticks right here the corners look pretty good maybe a little bit on that one the edges look nice we'll flip it over on the back now this one does have that dog ear hopefully it doesn't affect the pages inside but we will see that in a moment again we do this very quickly so that we don't take up too much of your time but i will leave this in there so that you can uh Check that video out yourself. If this is one that you want to know more about, again, you can rewind and get right in there. Let's show you a few of the interior pages all around, not looking too, too shabby. And that'll do it. A nice reader copy, a good uh, addition to your collection, especially if you're looking to just fill some holes, and that is a great one. Richie Rich, right here, number 26. This is from 1994. And you can tell by the artwork, the color separation, it looks a little bit more modern than some of the uh, older Archies that we've been, or not our Archies, but Harveys that we've been working with. So we'll show you all the way around. A little bit of bending right there, some spine ticking, some spine stress. Certainly nothing that a, uh, a good pressing and cleaning couldn't help out. Is it worth to you to do that? Well, that's up to you. We don't tell you how to collect. Maybe you want it in absolute pristine. The pages look nice and bright. So we'll show you a few of the interiors and then we'll finish on the splash. No issues additional that I see on the uh, back of the inside cover, no writing and all around looking pretty good. Archie Comics for some Archie and Friends, number 39. This is from 2000, so about 20 years old now. And you can tell by that Furby ad. We'll flip it over here. It's a little bit tougher on these white covers, so I will take just an extra moment or two to really get the light in there, wiggle jiggle all the way around so you can see every last aspect of it. There we go. We'll do the same on the back. Now the back is nice and purple, so it shows out these flaws, especially right here in that corner. I want you to see that. Not too bad. A couple of the interiors. And we finish up right here on the splash. Josie and the Pussycats from Archie Comics. This is Archie and Friends number 54. We'll do the same on the back. And when was this? This was uh, 2002, I think. Yeah, so even though she's some kind of ice princess, one might think she's uh, doing some Khaleesi cosplay, but... Would have predated that by quite a bit. We'll show you that light as it wiggle jiggles down the cover. Looking pretty good. Not a ton of issues on this uh, spine. 
Pretty normal wear and tear on the corners. I'll show you the back. Let the light do its job. Then I'll do mine as we flip through a few of the interiors. Show you what you need to know. And that's going to do it for Archie and Friends, number 54, from 2002.